Um, hello everyone. In this video, I will show you how to schedule your R script. Um, so basically, um, if you want to run your R code at a certain time, you can actually use this way to do that. Um, so the first thing you need to do is go to um, the website to download um, a software called Program Scheduler front end. Um, basically, you can download this software from um, the software center. And then after you download this software, um, you can um, run it like this. So, suppose I have I have a R script in my um, current directory called Dropbox Stocks and this script is called test.r and um, what it does is to write a CSV file called test.csv in the current directory so let's see what can we do um, here so after you open this um, um, task scheduler you click new and then click a task that launches one time basically you can just name this as test1 and so by default it will uh, assume that you are in the home directory so the first thing you need to do is to change the directory to Dropbox and stock and the next thing is to run the R code called RC cmd uh, batch and test.r so uh, essentially you can um, write any Linux code here but right now I'm focusing on render um, R code um, so I just um, use the uh, command rcmd batch file to um, run R code and then um, I can set the time for example the next minute is um, 1048 so I can change it to 1048 and add okay so so then this script is on our list here so we can wait for one minute and to see here so yes as you can see um, the CSV file is created here and this job is done so if we go to um, our um, directory, we can open the CSV file. As we can see here, the variable x is written in this file. So basically, um, if you want to say like download some stock stock price data using the get symbol functions in quant mode, minus uh, in quant mode package. Um, the stock price is um, updated daily in the um, uh, in 12 a.m. So if you want to sleep at that time and let the computer run the code, so you can use this software to help you run the R code. Okay, thank you for watching.